Hello, in this video I'm going to be talking about KI-67, sometimes called KI-67. What is it and what does it mean? How do we use that information and how should you understand your KI-67 level? Before I go on, I want to invite you to subscribe to our channel. We're always putting out new content. You can watch videos from any time of the year. Today we're in a sunny summer day and my neighbors are mowing their lawn. I'd also love to invite you to go to yerba.com to get your personalized yerba report. I'll tell you a little bit more about that in just a moment. So KI-67 is a marker of tumor cell proliferation or division. The way we like to think about it is the higher the KI-67, the more on the go the tumor cells are. KI-67 or KI-67 often travels along with other characteristics. So for example, a tumor that has a high KI-67 will also be more likely to be grade three tumor. Those are some of the relationships that we see. We generally consider the higher, the more active the tumor. And this is really interesting. The cutoffs in different studies differ. So you might see a cutoff in one study of 20%. If the KI-67 index is 20% or higher, that's considered high KI-67. And other studies have used a cutoff of 40%. The other key thing to know is that KI-67 is one of our least reliable markers. What I mean by that is between labs, the same tumor can have a different KI-67% and in addition, different parts of every tumor can have a different proportion. So this is one reason we don't include your KI-67 in our Yerba report at this point. That intralaboratory variation, the interlaboratory variation, and the intratumoral variation means it's really hard for us to hang our hat on the KI-67. It's helpful to know that the Oncotype DX assay, which is an assay of multiple genes, will also look at the KI-67 and includes that in there, as well as other markers of proliferation. And the Oncotype DX assay and other assays have been validated in giving information about not just prognosis, but also the predictive benefit of particular treatments, in particular chemotherapy. If you go to yerba.com and get your personalized yerba report, as I mentioned, you won't see the key 67 in there. We do have access to the key 67, however, from your medical records when you share those with us. And if you get the premium version, you can ask us anything you want about the key 67. The bottom line is that we use other markers besides key 67 because of that variability. We use tumor stage, meaning tumor size and number of lymph nodes, whether the tumor is attached to the skin or chest wall. We look at hormone receptors, we look at grade, we look at HER2 status. And if you have advanced disease, we look at other markers. But for people with early stage disease, our report doesn't have the key 67 specifically called out under the tumor characteristics for the reasons I mentioned. Everything we recommend is evidence-based, and we explain the types of treatments you might hear about. Because we're not part of your team, we're not recommending these treatments, but we're saying these are things that might be offered to you, and sometimes those are things you haven't heard about. So we expand the options, but we also help understand the attributes of those options. What are the pros and cons? What's the schedule like? That sort of thing. We also give you sets of questions that you can put in your queue and take with you to your doctor's appointments. This can help you feel really prepared for your medical visits. We strongly believed that the best medical care is based on high quality information and values concordant decision making. So what's important to you? And your Yerba report will help with all of these. I've covered a lot today. I hope it's been helpful. Drop a comment or a question below. We get back to you within one to three weeks. We love the engagement. If you have thoughts about whether Key 67 helped you in your decision making for your cancer treatment, tell the rest of the community. As always, thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.